So again, that candle factory in Mayfield, a focal point in all of this fatal devastation. A woman who works there is in Alabama tonight with family. That family from Colbert County drove up to rescue her, bring her home to safety. And after seeing the tornado destruction firsthand, they obviously feel led to help. So they know Christmas presents aren't a priority for storm victims who've lost everything. But they want to uplift the little ones in that town as residents there piece their lives back together. News 19's Madison Neal has their story. I talked with Shirley Lee, who lives in Mayfield, Kentucky, and works at the MCP Candle Factory. She says she was off work when the tornado hit her town, and she rode the storms out in her house, but she's still lucky to be alive. And the first person that came to my door, I heard a knock on the door, and it was one of my supervisors, Bobette, and he came to see about me, and he was one of the unfortunate ones. His wife was trapped in there and he, they couldn't get her out alive. Lee says the second knock on her door was her daughter and son-in-law. They drove from North Alabama to her rescue. Her whole street, almost every house has a tree on it. So we rode around and we looked at the damages and it was just devastating. And I'm just so lucky to be here. After seeing the devastation firsthand, Brittany and Brendan McCollum decided they had to do something to help. We're doing a couple different things for the community, but one of our projects is we're going to collect toys to give out to the kids who have lost everything on Christmas and Christmas Eve. Making sure kids who have lost everything are getting a little something this holiday. We just talked about it and we was like, it'd be a good thing to bring some happiness to the city. Shirley's house, like many in Mayfield, is unlivable, so she's going to be in Alabama for a while. And the McCollums say they're going to be making a trip to Kentucky this week to deliver food and help with cleanup efforts. Reporting in Colbert County, Madison Neal, News 19. Toys can be dropped off for donation at CBNS Bank in Cherokee and People's Pharmacy in Cherokee. Monetary donations can be made to the Mayfield Community of Christ. We all have the information on our website, whnt.com.